patients at the Sir Joseph Nombri Memorial Hospital in Simbu province wanting to buy prescribed drugs can now easily access a city pharmacy branch there. The opening of the pharmacy has been described as a great relief. According to the Provincial Health Authority CEO, most prescriptions were written and given to patients to check pharmacy outlets in other neighboring provinces. No hagen or Logoroka and you know go, you save him bus fare, you save him this la risk. He got no travel or highway, every risk. Now you know you know need you go now because something is done. Local MP Mugua Dilu thanked CPL for entering into the public private partnership arrangement with Simbu Provincial Health Authority with the support from the provincial government. Anyone a very smart decision where former board now you all health professionals, you are working him long, form him, partnership for them, CPL, or Karim CPL, Kamenzolo, Simbu. I mean, talk, thank you. I am got plenty benefit from Yumi, long province. Yumi, all sick man, by kissing Madison, he sit us all 100 meters away, you walk about going south, now you say Madison. You don't need to travel or bus. Chairman of CPL Group, Se Mahesh Patel, was also a guest of honor there, said he wished to see local entrepreneurs with pharmaceutical education helping in rural communities. Today I actually do a challenge to all the Papua New Guinean pharmacists that have graduated or will graduate. We don't want city pharmacy to keep opening in smaller towns. We want you, a Papua New Guinean citizen, to open a pharmacy where we can help them to go out to various places. So we'll do the main, let's get the youngsters of this generation to go out and open businesses. We will support them. Se Patel added that quality health services in the country needs partnership with relevant stakeholders. Lindy Suharupa, National MTV News.